create a new project Android Studio and choose empty activity and click on next I name the project as splash screen so sorry splash screen and click on finish is our project is ready build is successful our main activity is Java and this is our XML file want to split the screen and let's go to coding first of all remove the hello world program and it's ok and let's change the constraint layout to linear layout and this is the gravity to center you can all the elements in the center of the interface the user interface and go to the resource file drawable and again create your resource file named as splash bg for a splash screen background and click on ok then change the selector to shape and just start coding with the gradient start color and set as a black color first and choose from the color palette if, what do you need and set the color as per your requirement and next to the end color so android end color and also set the into it's set into black and choosing a color from color palette and it's ok and we have to the gradient is not horizontal but we can use vertical so want to angle give to angle 90 degree then don't say it's not save and close the splash bg and go to the xml file i want to background at a drawable splash bg all set the background is set now and we need a image view so image view and here's the 150 dp width and 150 dp and 150 dp height and then we have a we need a id for the image view as a splash image splash img i give you splash img and copy the image do you want to and paste it in on the drawable file then click ok ok and use it as an src src means the source file for image view at drawable disney so making disney as a splash screen and the margin top we need to open so already we so let's add sender so I need to minus 20 dp it's all right and then go to the main activity to java main activity dot java file create and write private static int name as a splash screen splash screen and give it is time 3000 is in millisecond and in the in this section new handler port post delete and new runnable file create a runnable file and in it create an indent first indent to from main activity to the home activity the home activity will be later created the dot this to the home activity dot class home activity is not not an error showing but start the indent activity the indent and finish off let's create the variable as splash screen ok and let's create a new activity activity named as home activity and finish and main activity the home activity we 
all right and into the activity home we need to design a only a text view for that for first of all we change the constraint layout to linear layout and a text view with the wrap content and wrap command with then height and so gravity is center for the linear layout and android text is equal to with this test there this is the home screen after splash of course you want to verify that this is of course when the splash is occurred and the size of the test is db and and the text style is bold so our go to the main activity okay run the file so build is build is success wait for it just means okay build is success and install is completed on our emulator yeah it's local you uh, and then our splash plan is run successfully and indent to the home activity to to remove the action bar go to manifest file and select the theme and to the splash screen theme dot have come back to dot no action bar so it will remove the action bar so let's run again it's completed and look this looking good the splash screen is ready, ready.